We are the Smart Local. The Smart Local.com. Tell me what you think is gonna happen today. We are gonna experience what it's like to be disabled. Yeah. Fauzi, Audrey, who's gonna be helping me. Annabelle and Xenia. And those are our three facilitators. Hi, I'm Debra. Cool. Hi, I'm Ryan. And that is Daniel. Daniel. Name is Daniel. B A N I E L. Daniel. Yeah. Cool. So, and, and I am behind the camera. So we are going to walk to um, Bukit Tima to have lunch. Oh my god, I'm going to die. <laughs> are you stressed that you cannot hear anything? Stress. Yes. Stress. Thomas, am I close enough to kick you? Yes. Everybody was kung fu fighting. <laughs> ha, I lied. Actually, I have a question for you guys. Blindness, right? As far as I've read, that, you don't, you don't that feeling when you open your eyes, when you've closed your eyes for too long. That's right. So that, that's the thing about blindness. If you guys really know what blindness is, it sounds way more painful than usual. So how do I go down like that? I princess carry you up. Don't you want? I won't give up us. So what would you guys advise right now? So no Oi! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you must listen to him talk. So now actually we just have to take a longer route as okay. compared to like the usual able body. Mm -hmm. So that really like increases their time. Yeah but the question is really how are you getting down this? Uh, I've had a friend who was wheelchair bound once. When he sees stairs, he actually wheelchairs down the stairs. I can go yeah. I'm just stating an option which is not very viable. Like how do I maneuver through here? Turn the right hand more and pull the left hand back. No! <laughs> I do you use that. your <laughs> What I realized is that there's no brails here. So that's like low-key dangerous for you. No, but what's super scary is that like small things like slopes you can you hear. That, Annabelle? Yeah. Yes, yeah, I hear that's that. Your cue to cross the road. Yes. Oh, uh, great. Just... Immediately starts blinking it. Yeah. Oh my god! You can do it! It was at this moment that he knew. He f***ed up. Oh my god! Oh yeah, tired. This is so tiring. Okay, so Thomas is now taking over. The bus stop yeah. does not have enough space to fit the wheelchair. So you can't wheel it through. So I have to go by the back. To the SO station now. Yeah, uh, Fauzi's pushing me for now. Oh my god. Taking a break. It's so bumpy and it's very dangerous, I would imagine. If you, let's say, you had to push yourself on this road, right? Like, it's scary lah. You know, Xenia is usually one of the bubblier people around. Yeah. Yeah, then she's so quiet. Fauzi, <laughs> you want back on or? Uh, I'll just push you. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, help. Oh my the god, lift isn't working. Yes. The lift is not working. So Ryan's wrecking the other route that I have to take if I want a wheelchair. This. And then up there. And then I think there's a zigzag behind and then go up. This is so hot. Oh my god. There's a wheelchair accessible table in the hawker center. But because somebody else is taking it, all of us who are like able and walking, right? We just choose whatever table we want. I didn't even know, I didn't even know there are. No. Yeah, I don't like the idea of having someone, you know, care for you every time. Having like uh, your ability taken away from you, and then like you have to rely on somebody else. It's it's a tough thing. Uh. So how would you order a meal with a lot of specifications as a deaf person that is? unable to articulate your words clearly. I am going to order uh -huh. fish ball noodle, dry, mee pop, no chili, a lot of ketchup. When Zine was trying to like point to the noodles, so Andy even went in and took out the noodles and asked what she wants. Mm. Yeah, so that was actually, you know, the small things that we can make life better for person with disabilities mm. yeah so like just small steps yeah where's Fauzi? hi guys so we just finished eating lunch now and now we're heading to a supermarket to handle a new challenge and we're switching it up okay, i hear cars moving uh, behind me okay, it's kind of scary it's more tiring than my touch truck training it feels like my world just shut down you so like dependent on audrey now 
and I'm very thankful that she's here. Because I really wouldn't know what to do, seriously. Oh my god! <laughs> Shit! <laughs> Wait, no, is no, that no, okay? No, no. $2? So this is, this is the Sounds like a magic okay, show. This is the shortest, um, yeah, shortest note. Okay. Okay, then the okay you don't tell me. I will. Okay, you just jumble. I'll try to guess, okay? Test me now. This is $5. Nice. How do you get it? $2. In front, in yeah, in front. Yeah. Are you, are you kidding me? No, there's still one. Also, why is it? This is $5. We have a challenge, actually. We need to buy all these things. You ready, Fauzi? Yep. Oh, I love that. You know that. You but you cannot reach. I feel the love. I feel the love, Fauzi. <laughs> I can help Wait. you, Xenia. Okay. <laughs> Tag team. Okay, okay come. Wait. Crispy okay, fish Robert. cracker. Oh, no, no. So Fauzi is a member of the uh, FNDC, so okay, he's gonna try to find his card now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The black one. Oh. Right. <laughs> cannot. Eh. Like it's. It, I felt very emotional in the middle of the mall. It's just struggle to even get one thing. So right now we are going back to their office. We're about to learn sign language from Daniel and Deborah. Hey. M is oh my god. <laughs> Wait. 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 Right now your name is Yu Yu and I don't know what. The correct way will actually be on the elbow. So just. I think it's very. Interesting in the sense that you're put in their shoes. You don't you don't realize how tough it is to like live live your life with a disability. It really like forces me to rethink how I see the world and how I see people with disabilities because they have it tough. And I feel super excluded when I'm there. Most mm. of the time I don't even know what you guys are talking about. That's what people yeah. with disabilities feel in our society. I think it's very important to know that uh, one small action of ours can really like make their lives a lot easier or a lot harder. If you want more information about society staples, you can go down to the descri description box. You can find out all their stuff. They're looking for volunteers, so if you're interested, maybe you write in and then do your part to kind of help raise awareness about inclusion in Singapore. Uh, and as always, thank you for watching this video. You can like, share and subscribe and watch our other videos over there. Cool. And until next time, bye guys. See ya!